I'm standing in front of what could be the most famous dog sled kennel in Ontario. That is after a Facebook post over the weekend criticizing this location went viral. I'm Christina Howard and this is Windrift Kennel, a kennel that's actually in the spotlight for all the wrong reasons. Caution now, the video you're about to see may be disturbing. <laughs> This video was taken over the weekend. It shows sled dogs chained up with very little running room. This is apparently how they're kept when they aren't sledding. And this dog in particular appears injured. One of the reasons behind the original post. Come here. Come on. Oh my God. The owners of Windrift Kennels have never been convicted of animal cruelty charges in the past. The OSPCA won't say if they've received complaints or even charged the kennels owners in the past, but they were on scene today investigating. The owners would not allow City News on the property and did not offer us a comment. Veterinarian Kent Ackerman says only one dog is showing symptoms of concern. I, I agree with, with people who see this film that there's some disturbing issues here and one that's very clear that I can say as a doctor um, there was a dog there with a wound on its leg left front leg and it has not been taken care of by a veterinarian if it has uh, it is certainly not being taken care of Apparently, it's rather common for working sled dogs to be housed this way Ackerman says the other dogs appear healthy so in general, these dogs are a little bit thin, but they look like they're in good health and they have very good mannerisms. If these animals are well socialized and, and they are out and they're doing their job multiple times a day, uh, it is humane to have these dogs chained up. If you have them running around free, you can actually have a lot of fighting and interaction problems. So it's actually safer to have them chained up. The kennel is licensed by the town of Oro Medante and passes regular municipal inspections. Now, although this is a 65 acre property, you can oftentimes hear the dogs barking all the way out from the road. Now, the OSPCA has declined comment and says this is an ongoing investigation. No word yet on whether or not charges will be laid. North of Barrie, Christina Howard, City News.